the snow has long been melted from our previous episode. Winter has finally passed. As the heat of the summer starts to pick up, we return to the land between the lakes to enjoy a night of camping and paddling along its lakes. But before we get to that, we have to go through the devastation left behind by powerful tornadoes. While exploring, we had a conversation with a local hiker. We learned a great deal about wildflowers, including a rare one that grows around a campsite along this trail. So after our friendly chat with the hiker, we went our separate ways and we found this marker for what seemed to be an old site where a school once stood. It makes us wonder what this place looked like back then. Speaking of the past, most of the challenging trails in LBL are now filled with gravel and made accessible for all types of vehicles. While it's good to know that more people will get the chance to enjoy these places, the increased traffic brings one annoying situation. Cleaning up a little bit, we took a break before searching the area for wildflowers. After our quick stroll in the woods, I decided to check the water out. The lake is peppered with these yellow flowers. 
it's fascinating that they continue to flourish despite being underwater. Soon after, the whole family decided to join. Unfortunately, our fun was cut short by the pouring rain. On the other hand though, there are plenty of chores and adventures to be had outdoors. So we parked the kayak for now and prepared our dinner instead. The following day, the weather was finally looking up. And we were all excited to spend more time in the water, especially this little one. Down, Max. I know. I know. Let's go. We really like to love our Sea Eagle kayak, but at 62 pounds, it takes a lot of space and a lot of energy to pack up, which is quickly becoming a painful task, especially on multi day trips. Our search for a much lighter way to enjoy the water led us to a Colorado based company named Coco Pelly. Coco Pelly makes lightweight rafts and kayaks that you can easily strap on your backpack and take with you on your hikes, or vice versa. We immediately fell in love with the idea of exploring remote rivers and lakes. Most importantly, you can go as light as 6 pounds, or our more rugged choice for 14 pounds. Both our lower backs couldn't be any happier. Definitely a welcoming change. Thank you for riding and paddling along with us, and we'll see you 
for more summer adventures.